So I decided to try Star Citizen because I saw so many positive comments about that and well I did make my character and I just did explore a bit around. I was a bit surprised. Uh, to be honest the experience isn't that great yet. I mean it was a terrible experience to create like, um, like a character. It was really, really like a big challenge. It took me like five to ten minutes to figure out how to create a character, which is not good. And we're just about to enter the spaceport. Oh, let's check it out. Yeah, okay. Well, at least I believe we are in the spaceport. Oh, we are not yet in the spaceport, so I did miss the stop. Okay. Well, let's get the train on the other side, I mean. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, basically, I created a character. It was a, a bit of a challenge, if I'd be honest. And then... There we go, the train is coming. Okay, so we still need to travel, we are not ready. And some other player, I guess. Anyway, it was a challenge to create a character, and it was like really tough to. I navigate at first through the home menu with the interactions and so on. Uh, the performance is terrible. Uh, most of the games that they run on my laptop are like really high end and they are smooth, like 60 FPC, but for some reason this one not so good. But I guess that is because it's alpha test yet. He has a nice gear. I like it. Are we at the spaceport? And what is the next stop? It's, it's the spaceport, I believe. New Babbage Interstellar Spaceport, yeah, it is. Finally! <laughs> so I'm pretty sure that uh, you have the option to use your microphone in the game, which is strange to be honest. Um, there is like no option to be like a uh, click. Uh, to speak or at least I haven't seen it and as you can see the performance is terrible like really terrible um, I'm using usually uh, i9 3800x Higgs uh, hash Higgs I'm sorry hash Higgs uh, processor and then I have 64 uh, 60 uh, 40 60 uh, GPU um, NVIDIA GPU with ray tracing and everything and the game is right now on I believe high settings yeah it was very high my standard settings were very very high but then I moved it to high so to see I can uh, to see if I can you know improve the performance but I was unlucky I will try with medium settings now this sync is turned on and from what I can see, it's terrible. I mean, it uses like 96% of my RAM, and then it doesn't use my CPU that much. It's just like 5% CPU. I mean, I have a powerful CPU. You should use that. I'm not just relying on my GPU. 
and uh, from what I could see in the options, um, yeah, um, just give a moment. I know I saw it somewhere down here. Uh, not this one. Combat music, no device optimization. What? Why did they name this device optimization? Weird. It should be sound optimization or something like that. Anyway, controls. I'm pretty sure there was like somewhere. Ah, there we go. It's in comms. Enable level activated voice transmission. No. So I made sure that uh, to keep it on off. I don't want everyone to hear me. I have no idea what those options are. I have like a small camera on my on my PC, and um, to be honest, uh, I tried to uh, like to capture my face or something like that for the game, so it can uh, create a character close to, my, to how I look. But well, I don't think that uh, this is an option yet. There is like head tracking and stuff here that aren't working. Uh, at least not with the camera that I have on my laptop, but it's not the best camera, so I wouldn't say that it needs to be any better. So let's continue. We are on the spaceport, and performance is a bit better now. We have like 40 FPC. Well, it's better than 20 FPC, I guess. How the fuck do you go up? Is it through the elevator? I guess it is. Elevator code. We're waiting. There we go. I like that it's like realistic. I mean, you. Uh, Ambis terminal, I guess. I like that it's um, like realistic uh, the wait times. For example, I've traveled several, uh, several in several places in the world, and uh, pretty much the waiting time is the same. Like uh, between five to ten minutes is the usual wait time, but when you drop down that to a game, it's like ten seconds or something like that, which is quite well optimized. I can, you know, um, only upload the game for that. So we're finally here. My, uh, thank you for your patience. Make sure that you have all your belongings before leaving security. Okay. Ah, there we go. Space of part lobby. So the game basically has about screens. I mean. Not in the fashion that uh, you would expect, like uh, a screen server screenshot and then, you know, the spinning uh, wheel thing, but uh, it does have because I did notice that when I was uh, dropping down from the elevator, uh, you know, the area that uh, I first ended up and then dropped down from the elevator to the main lobby, uh, there was a world screen, like uh, not noticeable but there was a world screen in the back end and it even stuttered uh, while uh, I was going down to the lobby because the game is once more not optimized uh, and that is a terrible experience. I believe that those I believe that those uh, controls are a bit clunky. I don't like first uh, person uh, gameplay through. I do use like this way but most of the things, the moment you click on F and then everything uh, switches to F person, first person, so to speak. It doesn't remain on the third person, you cannot uh, zoom out from third person and so on. And to be honest, I'm completely lost with, uh, with the whole thing. Like, how do I drink that? Please explain to me. What, Kerry? This this whole thing, like clicking from one menu, one object to another, so you can move it to your hand, it's like so unimmersive. Like, why? 
okay and then uh, what was it yeah it was F also oh, it's like it's empty that is why I cannot drink it I believe it's empty it's well it's not opened or if it was I have no idea like I don't have the option to drink it so I guess it has like uh, you know ended or something like that give me a moment I don't need that one in this case then well, let's try this one. Oh, this one is empty too drop the item I don't need it there we go how do you I have to carry it to drink it seriously yeah there we go drink this is like the whole thing with uh, moving through the menus is so annoying okay we are ha hybrid hydrogen it or whatever it's called what <laughs> where did my man go come on there we go Ah, this is good. This is good. I can move it like directly in my inventory by dragging it. That is very good. Okay, I didn't find out about this one. I'm happy that I did now. Okay, he just ate the whole apple, like, with, with the nuts and everything. Okay. <laughs> ships only. Fleet manager, ships only, okay. Well, we are fleet manager, I guess. Uh, do you see that how the chat is like really annoying up here? Request delivery. Hangar 4. Okay, okay let's find Hangar 4. Okay, it's this way. Is it like going through a door or something? Like, okay, oh, this restricted. I guess this is the security team. Is it like through here? I'm not sure. I'm honestly not sure. let's see yep it is here let's go to hangar but wait if hangar 4 is like over there why do i need elevator weird okay let's continue we will play a bit more and see how things will go Okay, I guess this is the one. Is it it? I didn't check if there is like any sign or anything like that. What is that? Okay, going to Hangar 4. So this elevator is moving really weird. Okay, there we go. We are in Hangar 4, finally. Uh, just want to add here that uh, through each of those doors that we just passed, most likely there is like a wall screen. My SD is just too fast in walls right away, so...
Okay, this ship is so small. Can this even hear me or something? I don't know. Uh, how do I get on it? Okay, it's not true here. Uh, come on, come on. Is it true here? Ah, there we go. Open. Okay, it actually can fit me. I'm surprised. Whoa. This is like few, just few inches above me. Okay, let's let's see how the the controls are for uh, for the uh, for the space fading. Let's say it. This whole first uh, person screen is so weird. Okay, we powered it up. Okay, now this is like that, okay. The top left menu button on the multifunction display. Select comms, then contact your current location permission to take off. Where is that? Uh, says it's on, on the top left corner. MMF. MFG, where the fuck are you? Okay, okay, so this is power off, this is engine on and off. Then where is the communication console? Okay, I have no idea what that is yet. Walls exterior. Okay. I believe this was the door closing. I need to find where to go, how to contact. Okay, is this the one? Engine on. Okay, we have a few. Menu? Maybe no. It's items. This is the inventory, I guess. Honestly, have no idea. So, the top left corner is over here, right? The top left corner. So, which one is the communication one? Because I don't see it. I honestly don't see it. <sighs> okay. Oh, please tell me that I don't need to press on those pedals. It would be weird. Okay, so this is the system menu. Okay, so we do have a menu. Target status, hit, power, weapons, shield, self status, comms. There we go. Comms and then... This one, I guess? Okay, thank you. <laughs> it took me only like 10 minutes to find it. I mean, do you, know, do you notice how 
uh, how hard it is to find something. And this is not top left corner. This is like left, far left. Okay, at least the takeoff is intuitive. Where do I have to go now? To ascend, hold space bar. To descend, hold left control. Okay, oh, but the left control doesn't work. At least. Ah, wait, it's working, but it's slow. Like, there is so many things up in my face, I cannot even see properly the screen and the game. I, I, I understand that I'm somewhere in space, but I have zero idea where exactly in space. Uh, follow the checkpoints out of New Babesh. Okay, where are the checkpoints? Come on, come on. Are those the checkpoints? I have zero idea. Oh, there we go. This is the checkpoint. Well, just great. Uh, why is it like this? Did I like? Yeah, I definitely did. <laughs> I turned around the ship like it's uh, horizontally like flipped. Let's say it flip. <laughs> okay. How do you boost? <laughs> Like, shift is not the key, I believe. Oh, it is the key, just it's so small. Is there, like, a place to... You know, turn around or something? Ah, there we go. This is the way. When so it's with the Q key. There we go. So this is the next place we need to go. And where do you watch our fuse? Stair, straf, straf up, straf down. The menu on the side. Do you see how it's quirk like? Absolutely not visible due to the blue uh, screen of the of the status and everything like completely lost. Would this be better? This is like third person, but it's still terrible. And this one is even more terrible. Like, how can I hide that menu? Like, I don't need everything like that, like, how much, uh, like, what is this LTM? And then I have Vel. What the fuck are those things? I don't need them. And that chat, Jesus Christ, I want to hide it. So far the experience is terrible. There is like potential in the game, don't get me wrong, and this is like an alpha state of the game, so I do get that. But Jesus Christ. So many things need to be fixed. Like interaction system, like control system, like huge system, uh, hood hood or whatever you want to call it. It's so quartering, like two quarter. Okay, this is going up, this is going down. 
why is this checkpoint like hundreds of miles away? I mean, I went through like several of those by now. Uh, well, this, this guidance is good by the way. It tells you where you have to go. And the bus needs rest because it's in the red. Do you see it on the side? I barely see it under the chat, but yeah. This needs to be fixed. Is there like... Angel CP Biscuits Global Chat? How can you hide the chat? Does anyone know how? Like, I did find the Kinzo, by the way. It's up here. The hit. Wait, what? Why did you raise my landing gear again? And how about the hit? Oh, when you are in the ship. Can you hide it? With some like red well and RTM. Okay, so F twelve for hiding uh, I need to I need to get I still am not sure why the landing gear the it dropped like why I mean why I was typing in the chat how do you hide the landing gear wait there is like cam bindings let me let me check them out so toggle walk Togo walk, okay, toggle walk. Cycle attacker, reset attacker, reset hostile target, increase engine power, decrease others, increase shield power, psycho camera view, yeah, okay, star map, we have a star map, really? Huh. Reset power, Decrease power, increase power. Ah, there we go. It says who here, toggle chat. Weapons on off, engine on off. Wait, you can turn off the engine from the keyboard, really? And the shoot as well. Weapon on off, accept, invi accept invites, power on off. Exit seat is with Y. I should remember that one probably. Psycho selection forward, row right, straf forward, row left, straf left, straf backward, straf right, okay. Interaction mod, yeah, I hate this interaction mod, it really needs update. Freeze glimnos, I still don't see landing gear i did turn it off from somewhere up here but i'm not sure which one free free walk come on. what else do we have space break cruise control scan model talk so many things that is why you don't make too realistic space game like there was way too many things to do and to remember
quite ready. Wait, you use my M buttons? Really? <laughs> oh, well, I do use them for something else. I don't use them for, for games, you know. I still don't see the landing controls, how do you turn them off? Oh hell no, you need to concentrate your shoe energy to the left, to the right. This will be such a terrible experience. Increase degree, scan focus, scanning. <sighs> oh, I'm starting, you know, to get tired. <laughs> Just reading all that. I'm still not sure how to trigger, you know, the Latin controls. Quite white movement what is that like conversion settings okay I don't need those but I guess a lot of people won't need them let's see I'm really trying to find where the landing gear is located but I cannot see it I really don't see it like those up here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 0, they're so confusing. Like, what the hell is Psycho Attacker targets? Do you mean like to Psycho your attack on a target? I mean, come on, explain better. Yeah, I really don't have any idea. Port Tesla, living arms zone in caution advised. Okay, so we are in open space and we can be attacked. Is that what's saying? So this is where we need to go. You see that? I have no idea how to increase, you know, the power, uh, not the power, but uh, to enter in uh, faster, uh, in faster uh, travel speed. Like there is like wide speed, if I'm not mistaken, and I just don't see the option here. QT mode, what the fuck is QT mode? It's charging for something, but... Ah, you need to hold it down. There we go, we found it. Something, something, uh, finally. I guess it says quantum mode, but why it's made name QT QT mod, like, okay, I understand, but for fires, you know, fires like me, you could have ex explained that. Too close. What do you mean too close?
Is it like I have to go here or something? Wow. No, no, no. I completely lost there. Rich Port Tesla. Okay. Am I moving right now? Because I don't feel like I'm moving. Out the Ah, there we go. I am moving closer. Finally, I can see it. Left out and and. Okay, so with why would out and and? Okay, that is confusing. Okay. I will forget that one. That's like 100% certain. Ah, okay, so you use this one. The mouse wheel and the velocity on the side, the veil, shows uh, that. Um, Obstructed. I'm going to make some star catastrophe. I feel it. <laughs> So we are dropping down because we do need to to get there. I have no idea how the why like, explain to me how do I land? Am I like oh I am on top of the station that is why okay I need to go down. I was like, wait, what is happening? Why I cannot land? But this is like the top of the station. This is the correct way. So the land port is down here. Okay, so we will go this. And then... Man, this is, bit, this is tough. This is like really tough to control this ship. Okay, so... There we go. We need to go and land over there. Where is my landing location? I completely lost it. Like seriously, where is my landing location? I was just seeing it. Give me a moment, I need to get out of here. Ah, to lower your landing gear, hit N. Okay, so... Cool. Okay, so this is the location. Man, this is tough. Is it like this way? Or is it like this way? I believe this is the correct way. No, it's this way. Why? Because this is zero one and zero three down there. So this should be the way. I'm glad that I have like the huge freedom of space with my controlling of the vehicle because like I'm so so bad at it
Okay. Let's see if it will succeed with the landing. Whoa. Okay. Thank God that this is automatic. Okay. How do I exit now? Ah, okay, Y. It says down <laughs> over there, exit the, uh, the side over there. Yep, I'm such a terrible uh, captain <laughs> of the spaceship. <laughs> okay, there we go. Yeah, it's a terrible experience so far. I think I have like 30 FPC here. Are you fucking kidding me? Come on, my card's not that bad. Okay, where do I have to go now? Like, where is my next... Um, next location, so to speak. Oh, I'm in Hangar 1. Oh, that's okay, I guess. Arrivals this way. Yeah, this is really something that I hate. Okay, we have a lobby here. You see that? This is like where the loading is happening in the elevator. So there is a loading screen. Store tutorial ship, okay. Ah, I see. So basically, when you have a ship and when you land on a port or spaceport, you have to retrieve your ship every time because uh, another player may use that hangar and probably cannot use it until while your uh, while your ship is there. Basically, this is actually smart. Is this another player? How do you recognize who is a player and who is an NPC, you know? Can I talk with you? I guess not. Yeah, we cannot talk. Well, that's too bad. Check your jour uh, journal, okay? J, I guess? It's not J. What it is then? L, J? When you say journal, usually it's on J. Why it isn't on J? Okay, where's... Wait, where is my food? And the drinks? I did buy several of those, you know? They just disappeared. What? Okay, let, let's see which, which button is the journal one. So we have J. That is for Jetson Cargo. What the fuck is Jetson Cargo? It should be ju journal. Okay, okay. Let's see. Modifiers, power on off. I swear, all this power on and off is like wait on. Oh, I have to change it. Okay, okay. Well, it would have been good if you explain it to me.
I'll just put this one up here <laughs> uh, because it was hiding the important bits. Okay. Mm. Let's move on. So we have weapon customize on J. Why? I, I say again, if you want me to check a journal, the first thing that a player will think that the journal is on J or L. It's not J, it's L. But it's neither of those here. The, the controls are so not uh, intuitive, you know. The inventory, okay, I agree. The inventory is okay on I or on B. Change fire mod. What the fuck is fire mod? Free hook, okay. Lean left, lean right. Move forward, move left. Okay, quick contact, air ro reward. Okay. Scoreboards. Where is the journal? I'm asking the same question like for several times. I have mission items on here. Why? Like mission items should be on J or something. Okay, or grenade. Yeah, the grenade is on J. Okay. Well, it's weird that it's up here though. And I do not see a journal. And it seems that if you use by mistake your numpad keyboard, you will vote your safe. You will either vote or uh, save things. Okay, that is so. Oh, wait, this is nice. The field to view. To increase it or decrease it on plus line mi or minus this one this one is right this is cool force respawn is on back an armed combat mod is zero okay why is zero why is not z and why is z is free walk and it's not v like view free walk you know usually it's on v Crouch control, okay. Yeah, it is either on. Wait, the medical is on C? Why? Why? It should be on, I don't know, on hash maybe? And the, the flash white is on T? What do we have on E? I would, I would make changes if I could. Oh, wait, I have a advanced. Control customizations. Nice. Okay. Uh, on food. Uh, let me find that. There we go. This is the one I need. Okay. Let's start with the with the with the with uh, the Z. This should be on V. Where the fuck is Z? Jesus Christ, so many controls. Am I blind or is there no Z here? Like free camera mode? Maybe it's not in here? Maybe it's a global setting or something? Okay. Where is the journal then? Let me check. Print walk, lean right, lean left, melee, medical pen, inject. Okay, I have no idea what that is. Dodge right, dodge back. Okay, that is intuitive. Bad token. <laughs> what? Why? <laughs> Why? Mm. 
rewards holster weapon. Why the reward and the holster weapon are on the same? What? It should be hold air if you want, you know, to holster your weapon. And I did, and I still don't see the journal. Is there like a search option? <laughs> there was like too many controls, and I would prefer much more to have like a look option. Okay, let's try, let's try uh, ground vehicle electronic access. Okay. Quick case interactions and inner tufts. Uh, journal. No, 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 player action, pit category. Well, I believe I will stop here. I mean, first look at the controls. They're like so completely confusing and they're like huge amount of them. What's operator mode? Ah, uh, this is the flight. So it should be captain controls or something like that, or fly controls. Why would you name them vehicles, seats and operator mods? What do you have for flight movement? This game is so unintuitive. I mean, it is so unintuitive. Sorry, but I'm completely lost. Where should I look? for let's say the journal like what is the what's the key to the journal why is not intuitive like click j open journal for example it makes absolutely zero sense and missions why they are not on l i forgot that i was here like why they are not on l and what is that up there that's glowing red?